What's happening? What's happening? Quick check in, man. So listen here, fellas. Uh, I don't know what y'all doing down there in Cartagena, man, but y'all need to stop. Y'all need to quit. Y'all need to stop. Y'all shenanigans. Okay, so when I go down there, man, one of my main things that I like to do is I immerse myself in the culture. And that means I like to get out there and politic with the people, whether that's being cab drivers, people at restaurants, working girls, promoters, whoever I find is cool people just because what they do for a living, I don't judge them. So that's led me to maintain relationships once I'm back here stateside. So I talk to these people on a consistent basis. Um, more so like some of the promoting guys and some of the drivers that I've met. Hell, it's just a way for me to practice my Spanish for real, for real. But, bruh, Colombians start to get sick of Americans, man. And what's happening, y'all going down there and y'all raising their cost of living. That's not good. We got to stop. So what that means, I kind of touched on this in my last video, man. I get it, fellas. Some of y'all coming from the States and we do pretty well for ourselves financially. And so we kind of will lose our mind or our common sense when we get to another country because we can afford it. Just because you can do something don't mean you should do something. So what's happening, man, y'all is raising the prices up of everything. The housing, the, uh, 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 the entertainment, if you know what I mean. Matter of fact, this chef, I got, I know a chef that works at uh, one of the restaurants over there that I, I frequent. Bro, hit me up and was just like, hey, man. Let your people know when y'all come down here, y'all got to stop. Because now the chicks is looking at us like, well, they paying this, so y'all should be paying this. They don't get money like we do. Recent situation really made me make this video. So I met a young lady the last time I was there. We exchanged phone numbers. I was just trying to be cool. I really wasn't feeling a shouty like that. But she wouldn't leave me alone. So I was just like, let me give them a WhatsApp. So she hit me out the blue last week. And I'm just like, all right, what she want? So after a bunch of small talk, her asking me when I'm coming back and she want to see me next time, she asked me for some money. Now, I don't block, I didn't block her because I don't have no problem saying no. So I didn't get offended. I just told her like, huh? I'm like, first of all, Charlotte, we ain't even got that kind of relationship. I don't even, I ain't even kicked it with you. Second of all, when I'm back at the house, man, my wallet come home with me. You feel me? Uh, shout out to Bo Race. <laughs> so after me telling her no, like she sends me this long paragraph pretty much calling me out saying, you know, you Americans, y'all on the bullshit. Y'all come down here and be blowing money and overpaying. And, but now when we asking for some help, we can't get it. And I had to explain to her, like, just because you see people doing certain things don't mean they living that way back home. I had to explain to her, like, it's cats that be taking them trips on their credit card or financing their vacations. That really ain't got it like that, but it can appear that way to y'all. So she understood where I was coming from and uh, eventually left me alone and found somebody else to go ask. But look, y'all, man, stop it. Stop it. Stop it. We don't want them people turning their nose up at us coming down there because that's going to lead to more fuckery. That's going to lead to more robberies. That's going to lead to a whole bunch of things that we don't, that we don't want. And if you moving down there, same thing with apartments and stuff. They jacking up the prices on everything because we coming down there and we severely overpaid. So I just wanted to put that out there, man. I'm glad that a lot of y'all is going down to Cartagena and uh, enjoying it, man. It's a beautiful city. Uh, Colombia is a beautiful country, but keep this in mind, man. Do what the locals do. If you wouldn't overpay in Baltimore, and I only say that because I got on the Raven shirt, don't overpay for nothing in Cartagena. Like, I don't know why y'all common sense stays in America when y'all leave to go to these places, man. Like, it don't matter down there. You don't have to do nothing extra. You don't have to make it rain in the club. You can be in the club with a Sprite they gonna choose. You know what I mean? So... That's all I wanted to say, man.